It is one of the, the biggest questions in modern astronomy. What is dark matter? I'm an astrophysicist and I study the universe. I'm interested in trying to uh, provide some information on how to solve some of the biggest questions about our universe. And the one question that I've been really interested in recently is trying to understand the nature of dark matter. Dark matter is uh, a matter, a substance in our universe that we think exists. It makes 80% of the total matter in the universe, but we actually uh, know very little about it. So I study galaxies, which are the best laboratories to study dark matter using telescopes and computer simulations, and also just pen and paper calculations. I was always excited about science, uh, about nature, and about how can we sort of use the universe in order to learn about the most fundamental uh, laws of physics. You know, now I'm kind of addicted to make uh, scientific discoveries. This feeling is just amazing. I feel like I was always curious about everything. My parents always um, gave me the freedom to just try whatever I want. As a child, I was sort of doing everything. Uh, I was in gymnastics, I was swimming, I was dancing, I was playing the piano. They just, you know, they just provided me anything that I needed with never, never judging me. Always, you know, you can just try. I started uh, reading um, some physics book by, uh, by Feynman and I just fell in love with physics. Since I have kids, I've become way more productive when I'm sort of uh, tired from family life. I, you know, I think about the universe and completely disconnect myself from everything else. And when I sort of need a break from research and science, I just enjoy family life and just, you know, watch my kids grow up. For me, it's kind of obvious that I should just, you know, keep going. And the fact that I'm a woman, that, that I have family, doesn't really matter for me being a scientist. Yeah, just, you know, go after your dreams.